when it comes to talking about other people. It's so easy to do that now. You can just make a couple of comments on social media. You can just send a message. Back then, people used to say something. Maybe one person heard it, they forgot. But now you post something and people come back and read it and the angel writes a sin against you again. And then somebody else comes and reads it and they write a sin against you again. And then people screenshot it and send it to others and the angel writes it against you again. These little taps of these fingers, they can, they can become very pricey. It's very easy to move your finger on the screen. But the more people are creating evil assumptions about others, the more you're spreading indignation towards someone else, the more it's being written against you over and over and over and over again. You know the idea of sadaqa jariya, a deed that compounds, it gets better and better and better. Share something good so your rewards increase. But when you share something bad, when you say something evil about someone that you didn't have to say, you didn't have to insult anyone. Because if you didn't insult them, nothing would have been taken from you. No risk of yours would have been taken away. Your life didn't get any better by insulting somebody, by accusing somebody, by humiliating somebody, by suggesting something evil about somebody. Nothing in your life improved except angels are now documenting every time somebody reads those filthy comments. Every time. And this has just become common practice. Protect your thoughts and your tongues and your hands nowadays from committing the kinds of sins that you and I cannot afford to pay on Judgment Day.